GTA 6 is one of the most highly anticipated games of all time, so it's safe to say that gamers all over the world are absolutely ravenous for concrete details on the next Grand Theft Auto game. For now, Rockstar Games is keeping us primed for new information. In terms of upcoming games, GTA 6 looks set to offer perhaps the most detailed open world we've seen yet. That's if Rockstar Games can continue the success of Grand Theft Auto V. One thing's for certain, the game is already looking very graphically impressive indeed. While we wait for more info on Grand Theft Auto 6, you'll find everything that's been confirmed so far in this video. When does it come out? 2025? On what platform? PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X and S? In terms of a GT A6 PC release? An ex Rockstar dev has explained why GTA 6 won't come to PC at launch. This stuff is very complicated, with the coding and the different things you have to do in order to get it to work properly, and all the testing you have to do. We now know that GTA 6 will be set in the state of Leonida, which encompasses Vice City and beyond. In a Newswire post, published just after the trailer, Rockstar describes the area as the biggest, most immersive evolution of the Grand Theft Auto series yet. We see a fair few shots of Vice City in the debut trailer, but it's still unclear whether other areas will be included at launch. A Bloomberg report published in 2022 claims that GTA 6 map was much bigger to begin with, encompassing areas based on both North and South America. This was apparently cut back during development, with Rockstar Games shifting and narrowing its focus to Vice City and the surrounding areas. These are likely the swamps and bridges we see in the trailer, based loosely on the Florida Keys. While this smaller launch map may sound disappointing at first, it's worth digging into other parts of the aforementioned report. Specifically, the fact that GTA 6 map may not remain static post-launch. Apparently, Rockstar plans to update the map with more cities and interior locations after release, mainly to give developers more breathing room and to cut down on overtime while GTA 6 is being worked on. There will be new missions and new map areas added on a regular basis. We're introduced to Lucia, one of the main protagonists of GTA 6, according to the leaked gameplay that popped up online early in 2023. GTA 6 could feature two playable protagonists. This is backed up by what's shown in the trailer, with Lucia and her partner currently unnamed. In terms of the story, GTA 6 looks set to follow the couple as they attempt to pull off a big score. Aside from that, we know that it'll take place in and around Vice City. We'll need to wait to hear more on whether GTA 6 will indeed it allow players to control Lucia and her partner. But for now, we know a lot more about Lucia than the unnamed man shown in the trailer. So there you have it. That's everything we know about GTA 6 so far. Thank you for watching, and see you in next video.